A controversial bill blocked by the governor is brought back by the Arkansas legislature and is now law. Thanks for watching. I'm Roly Hoyt. Governor Asa Hutchison vetoes House Bill 1570 yesterday, saying he understood that lawmakers could override his decision, and that's exactly what they did today. The governor's veto is overridden. The bill's passed. They'll I don't consider it a surprise. <clears throat> I stated my convictions and belief yesterday and uh, I understand uh, uh, their vote and the support for the House and Senate. Now, the governor described the bill as, quote, government overreach and hoped lawmakers would reconsider the ban, arguing that it could lead to an increased risk of suicide and other harmful effects for the transgender community. But he knew this was likely, as you heard him say there. The Arkansas ACLU released a statement following the override vote and saying in part that, quote, today's Arkansas legislators disregarded widespread, overwhelming and bipartisan opposition to this bill. And as Governor Hutchison noted in his veto message, denying care to trans youth can lead to harmful and life-threatening consequences. End of that partial quote. Now, the group says this fight is not over and plans to sue. The bill's sponsor, State Senator Alan Clark, told me that the governor and the, quote, liberal elite misrepresented what he calls protections in the bill. And the text of that proposal and the reactions to it are online right now at THV11.com.